Before this video starts, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing. One fourth cup of freshly squeezed lemon juice. I have three fourths cup of extra virgin olive oil. I have two and a half tablespoons of red vinegar, red wine vinegar. Seven to eight, I believe, garlic cloves. I love garlic. I have some red chopped onion here. This is about what? I'm putting about a quarter cup in here this to be really chunky so for my seasonings here I have one teaspoon of red pepper flakes two teaspoons of kosher salt two teaspoons of oregano and one teaspoon of freshly cracked black pepper just gonna put all this in here and now I'm going to go in and add my mixture of parsley and some cilantro in there and this is about what maybe a cup each and the way i'm going to do this is simply to pulse it because i want it blended but i don't want it to be um really fine my chopped ingredients or my bulky ingredients like my garlic and my onion, I want it to still have some texture to it. So we're gonna go ahead and crush this. All right, if you can look down in there and see what it looks like, this is what we have. And we're gonna go ahead and dish this up. All right, this is my chimichurri sauce. I think it came out really well. So what I'm going to do now is simply pour up some in a measuring cup because I'm going to be using this for two different types of meat. So I'm going to pour up what I'm going to be using here. Bowl I have, or in this measuring cup, I have um, my chimichurri sauce, and I have about a dozen shrimp in here. And I'm simply going to pour in my chimichurri sauce, and this is going to serve as my marinade. And I'm going to let it sit. For about six hours and then I'll come back to it and go ahead and finish up my recipe. Okay, I'm going to make sure each shrimp is coated. Alright, we're going to lay this flat inside my fridge and we'll be back. Go ahead and finish the recipe.
Um, you can see down in there, you can see that I've already mixed in some cilantro. I actually have um, some mayo mixed in with the sour cream. And I'm gonna go ahead and, um, also I have some garlic in there, I forgot, some chopped garlic. And this is a mixture that I mixed up just to have ready whenever I am going to do a recipe that I want to use it in, so I already have it on hand. going to start layering my dish that I will be serving this on. tortilla strips by Fresh Gourmet. This salad has everything in it to make it a number one on my list. It has your creamy with your avocado, also your corn mixture that can serve as your salad dressing if you don't want to add salad dressing to it. You have your succulent shrimp there, chimichurri shrimp. And you have your tortilla strips for that extra crunch. I have to have crunch in my salad, guys. Got to have it. So you have a whole complete meal here, guys. This is a delicious combination that I think you will really enjoy. Thank you. 